Here we are headed into the 2022 NFL season, and there are still people sleeping on the fact that these games are rigged and there are computer chips and magnets inside the footballs. Now, when I tell people this, the common man on the street looks at me as if I'm stupid when I inform them that the footballs have computer chips inside, that there is indeed computer technology inside the football. Now, I think personally they use this technology to manipulate the ball while it's in midair. Let's say during a field goal kick, you can manipulate the ball and have the kick bounce off the uprights thus causing one team to lose, one team to win, and the money switches hands in dramatic fashion. And they can control this. They can control the outcome of a final kick, let's say, by having the ball dramatically bounce off the uprights. And how do they do this? They're putting magnets and computer chips inside the balls. So all you have to do is just imagine that the field goal upright posts can also be a big giant magnet and you can use magnetic forces to send the ball left, send the ball right, send the ball down the middle, or like I said, have the ball just bounce right off the uprights. Have you noticed an uptick in the amount of balls bouncing off the uprights? If you grew up watching football in the 60s or the 70s or the 80s or the 90s or the early 2000s, you won't remember seeing the ball bounce off the uprights that often. It seems it's only become a common occurrence ever since the NFL admittedly started putting computer chips into every football. It's all done using a low-frequency transmitter that is integrated into the football. This is the rechargeable battery for the device. And then here's the actual uh, transmitter. This is the on-off switch so we can turn it off. These are the two wires from the antenna coming up into the transmitter. And here's the key. The transmitter creates a current in the wire, which turns the ball into a pretty simple electromagnet. So even though the NFL admits to putting computer chips into every football, still your common NFL fan, I'd say 90% of them don't even know this is going on. And of course, the NFL says they're only doing it to gather data, you know, like acceleration and velocity, yada, yada. I don't believe that for a second. I think if these games can be rigged, they definitely are rigged. And when we're talking about a multi-billion dollar betting industry where you can use your phone to drop insane amounts of jack on any game, including a preseason game, including the final kick during a preseason game, then you better believe they can control the outcome of said final kick. Now, this is just my opinion. You don't have to agree. However, if you choose to disagree, then you are wrong. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.